Good day, YouTube. Today I'm doing just a bit of a quick fun comparison video between Manjaro 21 on the left hand side versus Pop OS 22.04 on the right hand side. So both the latest releases, both running on the GNOME desktop environment, although Manjaro is based on Arc Linux, whereas we have Pop OS, which you may know based on the version in here, is actually based on Ubuntu the long-term service release there as well. Again, the latest releases for both of them. Now, starting off uh, with the GNOME desktop environment, you can see that uh, it is a little bit different here. So Pop! OS is actually running on a beautifully customized version of the GNOME desktop environment, but it does uh, take a bit of a, a, a RAM hit, and we'll see that in a moment. So we can see the applications menu at the, at the front there, which is nice enough, although we do have it on uh, both sides. So we've got it as a, like a little link here. There we go for Pop! OS, but uh, it's, it's, it's also down the bottom here for Manjaro, so nothing to write home too much about there. If we were to right click, this is where, uh, this is something I really like here. So this is probably the only GNOME desktop environment that I'm aware of that has all these extra options here. So Pop! OS really taking the cake here. Every other GNOME desktop environment has like these three really simplified options. Uh, so that's that's about it there, but I uh, see we can open in terminal So I'm very very happy about that. So go pop OS there. It's these little things that, that always seem to make a difference I feel Next up is the the file managers. So uh, the it will always be the gnome files as they call it there So I'll just uh, open up one of these and I'll show you so about files aka gnome files there So pretty much much of a muchness slightly different uh, Icon sets and, and color tones there, but nice dark mode for both of them So I'm very happy about that very pleased indeed now, uh, let's see. Uh, next up is under the hood, see what's going on. So, Manjaro is running on the 5.15 kernel, whereas Pop! OS is running on the 5.16 kernel. So, much of a muchness. It's going to support the same basic instruction sets and uh, hardware as well. Uh, the, the, the GNOME or GNOME desktop environment, also pretty much the same at 42. But, albeit, of course, Pop! OS is quite the beautifully customized one that I'm quite the fan of there. Uh, next up, uh, last but not least, let's take a little bit of a look at the CPU and RAM usage on boot up. So the CPUs, idling for both of them there. The RAM on boot up for Manjaro Linux is actually running at 730 megabytes of RAM on boot up there. Whereas Pop! OS, uh, this is, uh, you know, to be honest, this is the biggest downside of Pop! OS running on GNOME. It does use probably the most RAM on boot up, so 1.33 gigabytes of RAM. So almost double the RAM on boot up. Something just to bear in mind if you're using an older laptop, PC, netbook, notebook, anything with book at the end of it, you will probably want to avoid uh, Pop! OS. Yeah. But that's pretty much it guys, so thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button, and I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one. Cheers.